So, you just bought the Chimera. Now let's set it up for the first use. The first thing that you need to do is attach the top part with the lower cup. This is extremely important you do properly. Because if you don't, when the Chimera activates, the cup will just go flying out at an insane speed. It might hurt you, it might hit a wall and break, so the first thing that you actually need to do is to attach the paracord in place. Now you can fill your cup with BBs or powder, insert it into place and twist it so that the paracord has no slack. To insert the pin, push down the red latch, insert the pin with the flat facing down, rotate it, push it to the other side and rotate it again. This will create pressure on the red latch holding the steel ball in place. And that's it. The Chimera is now ready to be used. Charge it with gas for about 3 to 4 seconds. Wait until the gas pressure normalizes and you're ready to use it. Never use the Chimera immediately after filling it. This is what happens when you fill the Chimera with gas and the gas expands. As the gas expands, the temperature drops drastically. If you try and use the Chimera now, the seal will be very brittle and you'll have almost no pressure. Check out the temperature in the thermal camera. It immediately goes to minus 44 degrees Celsius. At this temperature, the gas has almost no pressure. So always remember, wait at least 5 minutes before you pull the pin and use your Chimera. Once the recommended time has elapsed, now you can pull the pin and throw the Chimera. If you prefer, you can also use a fast bang. The fast bang allows you to hold the Chimera in your vest and because the pull pin is attached to the vest, once you pull it, the Chimera is immediately ready to throw. And you never lose the pin because it stays connected to the vest. That is it for this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments down below. And as always, stay low, be the last to die. Cheers!